guys, it's Toxic Fox. Welcome back to day 16 of my 2020 Vlogmas Challenge. And today is kind of a spur of the moment thing. I wasn't sure whether I wanted to do a holiday cosplay this year, but I decided to do it. So that's what we're making today. We are making my holiday Tinkerbell. I just had to go with Tinkerbell because I thought it was really cute. And it's always nice to have another family kid friendly uh, cosplay, especially around the holidays. So I thought I would do Tinkerbell since I already have wings. And they already light up and they're pretty fantastic, so this is how I made my really super quick, super easy holiday Tinkerbell. So this project was super easy. You just need your stretch velour, a tape measure, something to write down the measurements on, some scissors, and your machine. So you're going to take measurements. You want to take your waist, your hips, and your chest measurement, just because you want to make sure that there's enough stretch with what you're making is pretty important for this project to make sure that it fits because you don't want to sew it together and then <laughs> it doesn't stretch enough to fit over your hips or over your boobs or like it's too baggy around your waist. So we're going to divide those measurements in half and then take your fabric, figure out which way stretches the best because you want the stretch to go around you, not up and down. And then you're going to take your fabric here and I just measured out 10 inches and then I stretched the fabric to see how much stretch was. There's a bit more than 50% stretch there. So when I did the math to figure it out, I definitely could stretch 28 inches to fit the 38 inches and the 40 inches of my chest and waist. So I sewed a tube that fit the 28 inches and then we cut triangles out of the bottom to create that little spiky bit. Then we're gonna hem those, stitch up the side, and then do a nice wide rolled hem at the top, leaving a channel for elastic if I decide to put some in there, but it does fit without it. And then we've got a strip to make the cute little scrunchy accessory that I'm making, because I can't put a hat on her because she has a bun. Just cut out the little triangles. You're gonna stitch them together and then flip it inside out. And you're gonna wanna stitch right along where the elastic is so that when you're finished, it looks like this. I cheated and stitched it together really quickly just because it's mine. But this is what the dress looks like on. It's just super basic, super comfy, and just a really easy cosplay. And that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed that really quick video, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.